Hi Aries, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I appreciate all of your love and support. In this reading, we're going to find out what does the person on your mind feel about your last conversation. Today is the 16th of July, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 10.38 p.m. Now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me. For Aries, the person on Aries' mind right now, how do they feel about their last conversation? All right, Aries, think about the person that you had your last conversation with that you'd like to know how they feel about it, okay? Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and the person on your mind. Seven of Cups in my verse at the bottom of the deck. The hangman. Not a wants my first strength. The tower. And I got the six of swords in my first. So there was an awakening here with the tower. Maybe something you said to them was very shocking. If it's if it wasn't shocking they may have realize something through that conversation okay since the last conversation the hangman look at the hangman's head with this like uh yellow light shining on behind the head here right that means you got them thinking you got them seeing things in a different perspective they could be mulling over what you said to them as well so hmm some of you, two different versions, first version would be like whatever you said to them that may have caused an ending or whatever, the second version would be whatever you said to this person caused this person to think or to realize something, okay? So they're stuck on that for a while, six of swords tomorrow. So something you said to them, it was very, very import important, also very drastic. It was big to this person, okay? So the Nine of Wands, here is in my first Queen of Cups, King of Cups. Despite the fact that either there was an ending or there was an awakening due to the last conversation, they still care about you. They still love you. Okay. Mm, it could also be them realizing that they love you and that they care about you. Okay. Something that you said to them since your last conversation. Um, again, bear in mind, roles can be reversed. I feel like they got a bit hurt by it, yeah, to be honest. Eight of Wands in one place. A bit hurt. But they're trying to be strong about it, strength. Trying to be strong, trying to maintain calm, trying to also tread carefully yeah they're trying to control their emotions maybe control themselves from feeling too hurt or crying or especially if this is like a separation or something that was just like very shocking the last con since the last conversation the chariot here is in reverse and we got the six of wands in reverse I feel like they didn't feel too good about the last conversation, but six of wands in my verse, either they feel disrespected or they they feel that you you're not interested. They definitely didn't feel on top of the world, okay? The chariot here is in my verse, they could be feeling as though, okay, I thought we could do something or move forward but then it's not moving forward this is a bit of a stagnant energy especially also with the hangman right here let's see a little bit more haven't done this reading in a while how does the person in your mind feel about your last conversation so it's quite funny the other signs are quite funny <laughs> but but uh, it's cool, it's cool. Seven of Cups here is in my verse. Queen of Swords in my verse. Three of Swords. See, I told you. Their feelings got hurt. They were sad, okay? Maybe the tower here. Something very shocking. You said something very shocking. Or maybe it could, be, could have been an ending between two of you. 
Queen of Swords in reverse. They're trying to bite their tongue here. Queen of Swords in reverse. So I, I, I want to say something back, but I, I think I shouldn't. I feel like they should hold back from replying or hold back from saying something that they were truly feeling at that point in time. Because again, strength is like holding back, right? Unless it's them feeling like you, you were holding back from telling them something okay again vice versa so cops are not first feel like maybe since the last conversation somebody's mind has been made whether it's theirs or yours it looks a little bit sad to be honest it's like i care about aries but maybe this is not happening so I just got to be strong with the strength card here. And we've got the Seven of Pentacles here in one first. Let's pull out a few more. Yeah, Six of Pentacles in one first. Since the last conversation, they may feel like maybe this is one-sided. Maybe it's not going to work out. The Magician in one first. Yep, it's not happening. Whatever they've been trying to manifest... In this situation, manifest this situation, manifest this, manifest you, or manifest this connection is not happening. So, the tower here can indicate also that everything just came falling down, crashing down, and it's just not happening. But they're still trying to be strong, but despite all of that, they still care about you, okay? So, Pentacles here is in one first. They still feel like both of you are meant to be with each other, be connected to each other, okay? Whether it's a romantic connection, friendship, or work connection, business connection, it could be any of these things, depending who you're thinking about right now, okay? Four ones here, it's in one first. Instability. Yeah, they feel hurt, they feel sad since the last conversation that maybe... Both of you cannot continue building this. Hmm. Feel like it's not happening. Because maybe unforeseen situation, unforeseen circumstances with the tower here. Alright, Aries, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to my other channel. It's called Chelsea Vlogs. It's my travel channel. And for those of you who like to be notified every time when I post your videos and every time when I go live, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. Whenever I go live, I'll do 12, uh, 12 signs reading briefly and I'll get to personal readings after that. They're free. Um, but if you were to send me super chat, this is when I will bump up your questions. And I don't have a schedule to go live. It's just a last minute thing. Usually it's up to my mood. But anyway, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button if you want to be notified. All right, take care, Aries. Hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Bye.